Hi, I'm John Kerry, co-founder of Designer Appliances, New Jersey and New York's premier appliance retailer. We're excited for today's video because we're heading down to Mila's Experience Center in Princeton, New Jersey to get a hands-on look at their innovative steam oven and dive into its convenient and versatile cooking possibilities. Hopefully by the end of this video, you'll know if the steam oven is right for your home. We're here today with Mary Mould, Mila's Culinary Events Manager. Mary, thank you so much for taking the time out of your busy schedule to host us this afternoon. As I was mentioning to you before, a lot of customers come to our showroom curious about steam cooking, but they're a little intimidated since it's a new technology. Can you kind of walk us through some of the compelling reasons why somebody should consider steam for their home, and maybe why Mila should be a top brand to consider? Absolutely. Well, when people think of steam, they think of rice and they think of vegetables, but Mila Combi Steam Oven is more than just that. We want you to think of the things that you do on your cooktop, and we want you to walk away from that cooktop and use the Combi Steam Oven to prepare some of the greatest foods that you've ever had. Um, we're gonna demo some of those today, and I can't wait for you to see all that. But we also, in the end, want you to remember that this is a full functioning oven. You can bake, you can roast, you can broil. You can do all of the things that you do in every other oven in your home. So if you're thinking of putting this in and maybe you have another oven, this is now your second oven because it has everything and some. From Mary's explanation, it seems like the steam oven has all the benefits of hassle-free cooking and convenience. Let's see if the results speak for themselves, starting off with my favorite, baby back ribs, which are notoriously known for being thrown on the grill. But can the steam oven get you those juicy but caramelized results that you love? Let's see. So now we're gonna prepare some baby back ribs and I'm gonna prepare them with some sweet and spicy barbecue sauce. We're gonna steam them at 212 degrees. And why we love to do that is because they will fall off the bone and give us that result when they come out of the steam oven. Normally, we have to wait six hours on a grill to get that same result. Mary was right. The ribs came out falling off the bone after the initial two hours, but to get that nice crispy caramelization you like to see on the grill, she transferred them to a universal tray that comes with the oven and rebrushed on some of the sauce. Another 30 minutes at 425 convection bake and a perfect rack of ribs is ready to eat in a quarter of the time it takes on the grill. This is a huge time saver and you could possibly put several trays in, making you not only a home chef, but the neighborhood rib master. What's cool is that during the convection bake cycle, you can manually release a burst of steam whenever you want to keep those juicy results. Next, Mary will show us the benefits of their menu cooking system. So with today's food trends, everyone loves the idea of sheet pan cooking. Putting everything on a pan, popping it in the oven, and an hour later, your meal is done all together at the same time. At Mila, we have menu cooking. And now I'm gonna show you how we're gonna prepare that same kind of concept. I've got some white rice, some salmon, and some broccoli, and we're gonna use the Miela Combi steam oven to prepare this meal so it all comes out perfect, restaurant quality at the same time. So now we're gonna prepare our menu cooking. So I'm gonna turn the oven on, and I'm gonna go to special modes, and the first thing we're gonna see is menu cooking, and that's what I'm gonna select today. This is gonna give me an option of all kinds of foods, and it's gonna allow me to enter up to three different dishes that I'd like to prepare. So let's open up this door, let's grab our rice, and let's place that right down here. Doesn't matter which level you use in the oven, any of the three in this oven, I'm gonna hit OK. The oven is going to preheat the water in the reservoir, and when I'm ready to add the next food, I will hear a tone, and it'll tell me exactly what it wants me to do. Mila's menu cooking system worked flawlessly. It cooked each of the items to the perfect consistencies thanks to its granular menu format. When Mary went to select each food, it gave several options to make sure the cooking results were optimal for your taste. For example, for the broccoli, she was able to select between whole or florets, the size and doneness. Once she added all of the foods to the menu in no particular order, the oven automatically instructed to put the rice first since that takes the longest to cook. The convenience of this function is priceless, especially if you have a hectic schedule. Have questions yet? Comment below and we'll make sure to get you an answer. Also, don't forget to subscribe for more videos just like this. So on top of these fairly basic cooking tasks, if you want to experiment with new types of cooking like sous vide, which typically requires a water bath, the Mila steam oven makes it even easier than before. 
Mary was kind enough to prepare two seasoned filet mignon steaks and was able to vacuum seal them using their new vacuum sealing drawer. When it's done cooking in the steam oven, you'll notice the meat has been cooked, but obviously there's not a lot of color or browning. So it's important to sear it on either a grill or in this case, a pan with a little bit of olive oil. But before seeing the perfect results, let's step back for a minute while Mary explains the importance of the vacuum seal. I wanna make sure that everything's in that bag nice and tight because I want all of the juice to basically envelop the bag with the meat, whether I'm cooking it or preparing it for storage in the freezer. So you can see right away that the bag is starting to fill up with pressure. And in a few seconds, what you'll notice that any of the juice, any of the sauce that's inside the bag starts to bubble a little bit, which to a normal person looks like a boil. If you were looking at this on the stove, you would think that this is boiling. Well, it is, but it's not boiling at 212 degrees. This is called a pressure boil. So that pressure inside the bag is now pushing all of that juice, all of that seasoning, all of that flavor right inside the meat so that when the, the air is sucked out of the bag and the bag is sealed, everything is going to be nice and marinated. So now you heard that stop, and in a few seconds, I want you to see what really happens when we seal this bag. You'll notice the door lifted slightly. We hear a tone, we can open, and now we have our beautiful sealed, vacuum sealed bag. Nothing's getting in, nothing's getting out. We can cook with this, or we can throw this right in the freezer for storage. All right, so now that our meat's been seared, let's take it out of the pot, put it on the cutting board, and let me show you what I mean about true sous vide cooking and the absolute perfection that you will see once we cut the meat open. So obviously, these are two different fillets. One end is a little thinner, one end's a little thicker, but you'll notice as I cut through it, we have that perfect pink inside from end to end, middle to top. Everywhere throughout, we get the same result cooking under vacuum, cooking at sous vide at low temperatures for long times, that is what gives you perfection. So far, we're seriously impressed with the steam oven, and it seems to do a great job when it comes to heavy lifting. But what about easy tasks like heating your leftovers or boiling eggs? We asked Mary to heat up a plate of leftovers that she had in the fridge from yesterday, pasta, grains, rice, and things like chicken that are dry are brought back to life using the reheat mode that incorporates a combination of steam and heat. What impressed us the most, however, was making hard-boiled eggs using Mila's signature MasterChef program. So one of the most simple things that people make in their house are hard-boiled eggs. They're not just for breakfast. We throw them on salads. They're part of our meal. And nobody likes to stand over a cooktop, watching water boil, waiting, and then realizing you walked away and you let your eggs boil too long. Now I'm going to turn the oven on and select MasterChef. In MasterChef, we have several different types of food groups that we can select, but I'm gonna choose eggs. I'm gonna pick the size of egg, which today I know that I put a dozen large eggs in the oven, and I wanna hard boil these eggs today. So I have the choice of anywhere from soft, medium, to hard. I wanna steam cook them, and I wanna start them now, but I even have the possibility of starting them at a different time or even making them ready at a different time. But let's get these eggs going and they're gonna cook for 12 minutes. 12 minutes, the oven stops, the eggs are done, and I don't have to worry that they're overcooking. It'll keep them in a warming function until we're ready to take them out. Instead of getting overcooked hard-boiled eggs with a green ring around the yolk rim, we got perfectly hard-boiled eggs great for cob salads or even breakfast meal planning. So, now we know your breakfast, lunch, and dinners are covered with the steam oven, but what about baking desserts? Not only can you bake cookies with convection mode, but it can also cook some of the most delicate desserts like custard without the hassle, and it's easier than you think. For clients that love to bake and do things like cheesecakes, custards, puddings, creme brulees, or even can, traditionally we have to use a cooktop to create a water bath or bain marie, which means using a huge pot, filling it with water, and then regulating the temperature. At Mila, we achieve that same result very easily in our combi steam oven by using steam and doing things like custards, which are so gentle, but will give us the perfect silky smooth result. What I don't have to do 
is mix anything, whisk anything, watch anything on a cooktop, and I certainly don't have to worry about any boil over, which when I'm cooking on a cooktop, I have to worry about keeping that controlled and clean. So everything cooks, I don't open the door until the custards are done. Mila continues to amaze us with the steam oven. The results with the custard were outstanding, and if you're looking to impress your friends and family with gourmet techniques, this steam oven will definitely do the trick. Thank you so much, Mary. As you can see, steam ovens are an incredibly versatile tool for your kitchen. If you have any questions for us about how to best incorporate steam into your kitchen, please leave a comment down below. Don't forget to stop by one of our New Jersey showrooms, just a short drive from New York, to see our very own Mila Innovation Center with the steam oven on display. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to our channel where we provide helpful tips and advice that will make you an educated appliance shopper.